Welcome, Liberans. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Ooh, Liberans, Liberans, Liberans. A lot of you women are going to be having some issues, whether it's transpiring and happening. Liberans, a lot of you, whatever the issue and the situation is, I see a lot of you, Liberans, are going to be having some issues. I see end is coming in. For some of you liberal ladies at the workplace, okay, especially younger liberal ladies. So let's see what is just popping out at us. Woo hoo hoo. Okay. Alrighty, ladies, 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 ladies. Um, positive thinking, ladies, positive thinking, it's because I see this is transparent and happening. Um, you gotta be positive. Whatever is transpiring, you ladies have to be positive. I see, um, justice comes up, some anger, uh, justice comes up. I see, um, um, a group of people, they gambled, justice came up against them. Okay. So some of you liberals had done something. Okay. You could have uh, gambled a situation and you lost because, some of you limbrans has made um a contract or a handshake and now um you are emotionally wondering if it's going to be caught in up on you and yes um it's going to be happening okay it could be you but it could you could have done it for someone else you could have um used someone else's name or use a reference to do a reference for someone and something is caught in up on you limbrans and it's going to affect most of the women, I see the men are having handshakes, um, whatever is transpired, I see the men have gambled a situation and is having handshakes, so I see men, you are um, safe, okay, um, there could have been, some of you men were having some legal issue, business issue or whatever, but I see you kind of gamble this thing out because men are really much easier to resolve issues and situations, so I see you men, Kind of handshake on a legal issue, but I see you women are very worried, especially young women. You're very worried and older women also. So some of you, um, whatever the issue and the situation is, an end is coming and an abrupt end is going to be coming in for young people. Okay. Whatever is transpiring, an abrupt ending is coming in for young people because of uh, some um, situation that you have done in the past that is affecting you in the future now. So you could have, you know, um, put something on your CV, uh, on your um, thing there that was not true and they are picking up on it. Okay. So you could have put something on your resume that is not true and they're picking up on it. Whatever is transpiring, you young ladies could have used someone else's information or, um, yeah, put something on a CV and they're picking it up. Okay. So um, I see um, you're in thoughts and I see sadness. You're in thoughts and I see sadness, especially um, for the young people, young women, okay? So I see some of you young women was waiting, waiting and in thoughts. Um, um, you could have been sent home from work or you could have been um, on leave. They could have placed you on leave or sent you home from work whatever that was happening and transpiring i see that they could have sent you home from work and is on leave whatever this was happening or transpiring is that you are worried because there was something that um you um young ladies has done in the past with your resume or when you were applying for this job there was some information that was um that you did not um that that uh, um <laughs> You had some situation, you know what you did, and you're waiting because they had put you on, um, like, they said, okay, um, you know, we're giving you a couple of weeks off, we, and, you know, whatever, whatever. But some of you young lady realize the reason why, and it's because they, um, you, maybe some of you were supposed to have a new contract, and, um, you know, they're saying, take your leave now, because, um, and wait for your new contract, but something that you did in the past is recurring and uh, i think that you know um that uh, um they're going to be finding out because th there it is it's, it's as if people um that is working in a certain company certain um company um is realizing some deceptive play 
and it's as if you're not airing anything and you know you know within yourself that you have you have done something wrong especially you young women and i see these people or looking over it and I see your contract is going to be ended um, especially women between the age of 18 and 45 your contract now all of you not all of you is for people who know that they wasn't honest when they apply for a job um, your contract is going to be ending okay I see what is happening here is that um, there is something to do with immigration and uh, papers okay and I see that um, they caught up on you and in order for you to heal this um i see you have to but but you young ladies um whatever is transpiring especially women between the age of 18 and uh, let's say 40 45 um and yeah your parents are going to be getting caught up in this situation because um they find out that you use someone else's information i see they're bringing in the lawyer and I see that the immigration lawyer is kind of going to shake hands with the judge and said, hey, I, I'm, I'm washing my hands from this. OK, so <laughs> this is it. This is what I've been saying to a lot of people. You've got to be aware of the shutdown. You got to be on the right side because um, people who have used false documentation and imitated documents in order to get in a country and in order to get a job. Um, you know, with the shutdown, it's like a lot of personnel officers and a lot of people, um, um, people who are like, um, what you call them, um, um, headhunters, they're, they're going to let you fall. Okay. Cause headhunters are going to be picked up for this and then headhunters are going to say, yeah, but this is the information that they gave to me. And they are going to say, did you check out the information? Okay. So what is happening and what is transpiring is that I see um, this issue is happening to a lot of you young people. A lot of you young people um, and either lied of, uh, on your CV, um, your resume, or you have put fault information on your resume. And I see that this is being checked out. And I see the, the worries, the ones who have done it, not everyone. Um, is going to be uh, their your contract is going to be ended okay um for the rest of you i see that some of you find out that uh, someone um at your work um you realize that something is off about this person and something about where they say they're from and uh, whatever the information was didn't um but something is off and i see that uh, whatever is transpiring with either the company lawyer the company lawyer is going to be uh, throwing you under the bus okay um because personal officer bring in the company um lawyer and the judge and the lawyer because listen they throw you under the bus because here is the energy of absence and you're very emotional so what you're seeing um for the people who know what they have done um because i see that your parents have to get a lawyer and I see the company lawyer is saying, hey, um, and no, I don't want to have anything to do with this. And I see the company lawyer is wiping their hands off. And here you have left uh, saddened because your contract is over. OK, um, so, you know, and this is why I go back and I said to people, stop using people information and stop lying on your, um, you know, your CV. I mean. It, now you are now blocked okay and you have not and this is not the first time that some of you have done this and they're going to be finding out because i think the company lawyer with the judge found out that this is not the first time that you have done something like this and i see that they are going to be um dealing with you and dealing with the situation now it's for some of you it's you for some of you it's someone else in the company okay so it could have been your company and whatever is transpiring i see that it could be your company whoever this person is this person is coming up as um you could have found out that this young pisces have done some injustice okay because this uh, um uh so you gotta be aware of uh who and whatever you're doing, because what I'm what I'm seeing here that is transpiring is that 
it's all coming out okay it's all coming out um whatever is transpiring is definitely all coming out and you're dealing with um a lot of people and i see that you liberan ladies who have a company i see you're you're really taking down this company um you are really checking everyone in the company now i see you um you are very 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 um upset so I see ladies that have a company or, you know, whoever is the managers of company, I see you're really upset. And I see you're saying um, to whoever at a at, at, at top level, hey, um, get her out of my company. I don't want to, I'm not going to be a part of this. It is not going to be, um, you know, killing the name of my company because I, you know, so I see contract of two people. In your company is uh, two people in your company is going to be fired I see you ladies who are managers are waiting from your boss to give the go-ahead to bring in um, uh, some top of the head of people um, so I see um, you know managers are, are speaking of a decision to make about these two people um, so I see you managers, so you could be managing a company or you're managing a department and you went to, um, personnel or there is going to be changes. There's definitely going to be changes. And, um, this changing could affect in you guys because it has to do with reorganization in the company. And these are the head of, um, companies. These are the head, the top guys that are making a decision and, um, it's all about, uh, making sure um financial stability in the company and i see they're going to be um paying off some of these people i see the, the um uh, young people I, I see young people is going to be released and they're keeping on or the cheap the cheapest people may be kept on but i see they're doing a mixture but they're taking people on with um this is based on the um your air your um, um work work experience so whatever is transparent it is based on your work experience because whatever the issue is and the situation is is definitely based on the work experience so what i'm seeing here is that i see that um they are going to be reorganizing and getting someone to come in and paying out sovereignty pay so you're going to be um let go some of you but you're going to be having a sovereignty pay because i see um you know this is like an handshake with um people in um top management place as if hey um look these are the lawyer and the and the um ceos and ceo is saying hey look i gotta get rid of some of these people because of the shutdown i'm losing a lot um and the lawyer is going to go to the judge and said yeah so um yeah you're going to be let go but you will have a sovereignty pay now when we look at this built with business people managers and business people what we're seeing is that there is a company some of you ladies who um had a company and i see that um whatever is transpiring um someone is coming in and whoever this uh, um some displeasure um conversation you you ladies some um it's like managers and uh, management is trying to get out some of you ladies um 50 years and older and um you know this manager is coming to you or see you always coming to you and say you know so 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 you thought that this person was a good friend and you're finding out that this person has already decided on your fate in a company because the judge already at you know um say yes um for you to go and i see you're going to be very angry i see you're leaving and you're going to be very angry and i see you're going to be thinking about thinking of the take on a lawyer because of what happened to you later so uh, you know it could be um your business or it could be that you're uh you have a company and uh, because of some um false situation that has transpired i see that um they made a fate so they might want to buy you out buy out your part of the company and i see you women are so upset because it's as if uh, you build a company from stress you bring in these shareholders and they now want to get rid of you and they already created your fate by a handshake with a judge 
and you were not aware of this. And I see um, that you're going to be pissed off and you ladies are really, really going to be hungry. And I see you ladies, a uh, friend is going to be coming in and is going to be helping you out. Uh, um, this friend could be helping you out with a legal thing. I see some of you are really um, feeling really distressed to see that your own company, they wanted to buy you out of your own company and, you know, take you out. So I see um, some of you ladies are having an emotional situation to deal with whatever is happening and transpiring. Um, you ladies are really having some emotional situation to deal with. And however, this is coming up and transpiring for you. Um, you um, it doesn't have to be ladies. Men and women are going to be dealing with some emotional situation in this four weeks after the 15 going on. Because you saw that there was some secret handshakes behind your back. And you're going to be finding out about this. But I see it is going to be ending because I see you're going to stand your ground and end whatever that was happening and transpiring. So I love you guys. Please remember to like and share. Namaste until next time.